Titration of dilute hydrochloric acid against dilute sodium hydroxide solution. This is a barrette. Wash the pipette with water. Then wash the pipette with hydrochloric acid to prevent the water left inside from diluting the hydrochloric acid used in titration. Suck up 25 cubic centimeters of hydrochloric acid using the pipette. Transfer the hydrochloric acid to a clean conical flask. Allow the tip of the pipette to touch the side of the conical flask. Wash the burette with water. Then wash the barrette with sodium hydroxide solution. To prevent the water left inside the barrette, diluting the sodium hydroxide solution used in titration. Add a few drops of phenolphthalein to a conical flask containing hydrochloric acid. The solution is colourless. Fill the barrette with sodium hydroxide solution. Open the stopcock to release the gas bubbles trapped inside. Record the initial barrette reading. Empty the sodium hydroxide solution from the barrette. Notice the colour change. Slow down the emptying of the sodium hydroxide solution when the colour is about to change. Run off the sodium hydroxide solution until the color of the indicator just changes from colorless to red. This is the end point. Record the final barrette reading. Prepare a second trial of titration. Repeat the procedure Place 25 cubic centimeters of hydrochloric acid into a clean conical flask.
add a few drops of phenolphthalein. Record the initial barrette reading. Estimate the amount of sodium hydroxide solution needed to speed up the second trial of titration. Notice the colour change. Slow down the running off of the sodium hydroxide solution when the colour is about to change. Record the final barrette reading. Repeat the titration two more times and take the average of the readings of the last three titrations.